Wait. วันดีอีกครั้งได้นะฮะกับผมคูยอมนะครับกับเกมแอร์ลซินโนติซี่นะฮะเราก่อนเราก็พาคนไอ้เจ้าสเน็กก็เป็นนอยพาไปทิ้งไปแล้วอยู่ในรัฐที่นะภารกิจเมเบอรี่เอาวัคเก้นโลโอ้ได้กี่กันที่นี่เหมือนเหมือนเหมือนจะเคลียร์แล้วนะแต่ว่ายังไม่เคลียร์ไม่หมดเพราะตรงนี้เป็นที่มีนี่ก็มีนี่ก็มีนี่ก็มีนั่นก็มีครับเอสโยชน์เลยเ
ตะกี้โพสเข้ามาที่มีท่าโดดแบบเตียงกาได้ยังไงเครื่องหมายเยอะเหมือนกันนะนี่คือตาแผ่นที่อีกแยะเยอะมากเลยมีกัอีหนึ่งค่อนข้างไกลพอสมควรไปที่ก่อนเขาเครื่องหมายไอ้พวกนี้นะฮะถ้าเราเปิดพบอ่ะมันอาจจะเจอบองใสของพวกละทิศมันเป็นมากเครื่องหมายเพราะเชิญมาร์กเจอบอกแสบางทีมันจะเจอบอกแสของพวกละทิศแต่ต้องเสี่ยงหน่อยก็ไม่เจอก็มีเราแค่เจอของโธ่เอ้ยทางความหวังไว้เยอะนะเนี่ยไปก็เจอแล้วตรงนู้นตรงนู้นก่อนกับเฟกก
big hurt or a little hurt? I don't know. Well, does it hurt like a bear biting you? Or a mouse? Like three mouses. No, like four. Ah, so a puppy bite-sized hurt. Got it. Will the hurt go away? Tell you what, you have to scare it away. If you roar like a lion, it'll run. Grr! <laughs> Good job. Now run along home. You must be a physician. Yes, I'm Lycaon. You must be a Mystheus. Are you here for treatment? That depends. Will I have to roar for you too? <laughs> Sometimes the best medicine I can give my patients is a dose of hope. I take it you're not in need of care. I'm healthy as a horse. You look strong and prepared for anything. My patients need mandrake herbs. There's a part of them growing by a little stream southeast of here. Are you too busy to pick them? Too chewy. A pack of wolves is resting near the stream. I'll pay you generously for your trouble. You know how to talk to Mystios. Is that all you want? The mandrake herbs? For now. Bring them back to me, and I'll pack at them for my patients. Then we'll see. I'll bring you the herbs. You said they were southeast of here. Yes, by a little stream northeast of Kira. The flowers haven't bloomed yet, but the leaves are a distinctive gray green. Thank you. <laughs> The count said the herbs would be near a little stream. That looks like it. These must be the herbs the cow wanted. Oh, yeah. 
yak mark. This should be enough mandrake herbs. Time to go back to the physician. ภารกิจนี้ก็สิ่งที่กลมกลืนเลยเนาะถ้าไม่มีจุดมาร์กเดียวโอ้แยบแยบไม่ออก Here I found your herbs Thank you I'll prepare these for my patients Could you please stay a while I'll wait I've crossed the herbs so they'll be easier to take Could you please bring them to my patients? Just tell them they're for me, l e c o u n I thought I brought you more herbs than this. I needed to save a double dose for my grandmother. I'll give it to her soon. Sure. I'll just deliver the rest then. Thank you. All my patients are in or around the Hora of Delphi. One should be at the animal pens to the west. One is building a house in the northeastern corner, and uh, one works in the fields to the south. Come back here when you're done. I'm sure I can find them. Ah, ไปส่งยาครับที่หมู่บ้านสามหมู่บ้านนะเราส่งยาที่สาสามที่ครับ Le Caon made this medicine for you. Thanks. See, I take care of these beasts, and Le Caon takes care of me. Too bad nobody takes care of him though. What do you mean? His parents died young. His grandmother raised him, but then she was born under a cursed star. Never mind that. He's a good boy. I'm sure he is. These herbs are from Glicaon. Oh, thank you. That physician is so thoughtful and so handsome. It's too bad he's decided not to marry. Why not? He just told me some nonsense about not wanting to burden an innocent woman with his worries. Personally, I just wish he'd been honest and said I'm not his type. I wonder why he'd say that. <sighs> Here, anything you need the mercenaries' help with? The followers are wasting food, Mistios. This can't go on. Wasting food? What do you mean? They burn food offerings to Ares, while people like me go starving. They must have piles of food in their camp. I'm desperate for food. So you want me to give you some drachmi? By Zeus, you'd do that for me. Here you go.
I pay Drachmi to anyone who will sail for it. Legan sends his regards. The medicine he promised. Thank you. Tell me, did he look well? He didn't look sick to me. I've seen him up and walking around at all hours, mumbling to himself. He seems worried. I should bring him some sweets to cheer him up. I'm sure he'd appreciate that. I delivered all your medicine. Seems you have a lot of people concerned for your well-being. Thanks. Um, my grandmother, Praxithea, I have to bring her the last of the medicine. Will you come along with me to her house? I think I need your help. Yes. I'd like to know what's going on here. Oh, thank you. Please, my grandmother's house is this way. Thanks for coming with me. Where are you going? Why do you ask me that? If someone is in pious employment to engrave injustice to people, as well as the gods, do they not deserve punishment? What did Praxithea do? She spoke false prophecies for years. Those who came to her for advice received only lies. Your what grandmother was an oracle? Yes, up on the hill in Delphi. She confessed to me recently that she never had the thoughts. Um, and only repeated the words she was told. Told by vile people with evil intentions. Exactly. Wars have been fought over those words. She can't be left unpunished. My family was torn apart by a false prophecy. If it was one of hers, I may take matters into my own hands. I know what you want to do. You'll just bring more shame on our family. I don't want to do this, Agavi. But for the sake of justice, we can't let Praxithea live. It's out of our hands anyway. Some strange men were searching the village today, looking for her. I brought them here, and they dragged her away. What kind of justice is that? You won't understand. She was an impious old fool. Now we have nothing more to worry about. Who are you anyway? I'm Cassandra. I've also been wronged by a false prophecy. It might have been your grandmother's. If we don't find her, we can't settle any of this. Please help me figure out where she's been taken. I'll look for clues. What did you expect me to do? All that talk about killing? A solution showed up, so I took it. That wasn't the way it was supposed to happen. Praxithea must have lost this bracelet in the struggle. But no ordinary thief would have left something so valuable behind. Looks like a contract. Deliver the package to the drop-off and don't damage it. If they mean Ligaon's grandmother, chances are she's alive. Anything strange going on around here? Well, if bandits taking over my cousin's farm is strange, yes. What did they do? Gave her a running start. She can't go back there. They've set up camp, and they're armed and dangerous. Interesting. 
Where is that farm? It's not far west of here, but I wouldn't mess with those bandits. Thanks for the advice. Praxithea was kidnapped and brought to a farm west of here. The bandits were hired to deliver her alive. Well, thank you for figuring that out, Cassandra. I'm no fool, Ligaon. Your sister put Praxithea in great danger, and you've been asking me about killing. Do you want me to end her life? No. It has to be me. I need to kill her. She's your grandmother, and you're no killer. You should give this more thought. She's my responsibility. I don't want her to suffer. That's why I asked you for Mandrake. It's a painkiller. But for now, will you go to the farm to stop those bandits? I don't think I can take them all on myself. Okay. Let's go find Praxithea. Thanks, Cassandra. You said the farm was to the west. I'll meet you there. That must be the farm where Praxitia is being held prisoner. I should stay hidden if I don't want to fight.
Dead. Uh, you are thank you, my child. We must get away from here. Could more bandits be coming? Please, let's get out of here. <sighs> thank you for saving me, dear child. Don't thank me, voice of Apollo. Or were those someone else's words you spoke? So you've met my grandson. You're right. I lied to everyone. I am so sorry. The gods should have killed me by now. Instead, they made me live with my remorse. Who wanted you kidnapped? These brutes didn't come up with the idea themselves. Please, don't ask me that. The ones who want to punish me now, the ones who told me what to say, they would bury you alive if I told you about them. The ones with masks and dark cloaks. The cult of Cosmos. Do not speak their name. Why did you spread lies? People trusted you. You were supposed to bring them the word of Apollo. I didn't plan to. Not when I was chosen to be the oracle of Apollo. But I met people there who told me I must speak the words they asked. Or else my family would suffer for my disobedience. Family? Do you remember telling a Spartan family that their younger child must die? A grieving mother with eyes like mine. I am so sorry for what you have lost. Grandmother. Did she tell you? Is she the oracle who brought ruin on your family? I'm sorry for what I've done. I accept my punishment. But please, don't let my grandson kill me. Likaon's a good man, a healer. This would break him. No, this is my responsibility. I must be the one to end her. I've killed enough people to know that violence has no end. Better to move on, and make the best of the lives the gods have given you. Move on? But you said Praxithea ruined your family. She can do no more harm. Killing her for revenge won't change what happened. Besides, didn't you tell me something about hope? Thank you for your mercy. I promise I will do good with what's left of my days. You're right, Cassandra. I might not be able to forgive my grandmother, not right away. But she can go on with her life, and I with mine. I think you've made the right decision, Likaon. Ah, oh, how do you do this? Decide who lives and who dies. How do you do it, Likaon? All those lives depending on you, needing your healing and kindness. I... I think I need you, Cassandra. Not to kill anybody or find anything. Just to stay with me. I'm no healer, but I think you've been through a lot, Ligaon. You don't need a mystius in your life. Go back home and be the physician you're meant to be.
Get a soldier. Anything a mercenary can do for you today? The eagle bearing Nistheos. I thought you were a legend. Those legends are only stories. I'm just a humble mercenary. I've heard stories about how you work with the Spartans in Megaris and help them to victory. I've also heard you have something to do with the wolf's disappearance. You can't believe everything you hear. Sadly, with the wolf gone, fear has spread through our ranks. There's actually a small group of conspirators claiming Nikolaus isn't dead, but a deserter. They're alleging no one's seen his body. <laughs> That's crazy. Everyone knows he's dead. That may be, but these men are convinced. They're deserting their posts and encouraging others to follow. They need to be stopped. You're asking me to kill all the Spartan deserters? That would be the idea, yes. All right. I'll do it. For Sparta. I'll come back when I'm done.
Ugh! <sighs> 
You're back. Have you killed them? I took care of them. Every last one. You've served Sparta well. This is for you. Happy to help. Haha, <laughs> nice man. Come on. Slow down. You're going to hurt someone. Is someone trying to mess with me?
anything Amistios can help you with, stranger? My dear friend lent me a beautiful necklace, and I need to return it to her for an upcoming festival. I fear traveling with it will make me a target for thieves, though. So you need me to deliver it? Yes, she must receive it, and soon. I'll handle this. Good. You're doing me a great service. We're done here. Manetera. Thank you, Mistios. Here, this is for you. Ha <laughs> ha! 
แล้วจากจะบานปลายเราดีขึ้นเรือก่อนได้ลมเหมือนภาคสองเลยอ่ะมากหนึ่งของเกาะมีปลาหาแวบนี้กันมีพวกลาทีอยู่แถวนี้นี่มันคายดีวะ Stop there This is no place for you Let's hope no one notices me here
ได้ว่าเคยเข้ามาทีกันแน่ท่ายเนี่ยวุ่นวายมากเ
แต๋วแตกแต่ตนตัวโตเลยบานเลยนี่
Much for his button. Help! I need help! <sighs> Ah! 
This far. Coming! Ah! 
เจอบอกใส่อีกหนึ่งอันครับหายอีกสามอันก็จะรู้ว่าเป็นใครดีมากเลยเจ้าเดียวไม่เหลือในกาดิเตอร์เหมือนกันหรอโอ้โหอยู่นู่นอยู่ทางมุกเกาะนะโอ้โหไกลามากโอ้ยยังก็ปลดล็อกแถวนี้ออกก่อนนะสิปลดล็อกสิบห้าจะไปได้
ไปลงเขาต่อยากแล้วเจ้าจะเจอโหโหดสูงเลยขึ้นเขาแล้วก็มาลงเขาตายแล้วเต็นจริงๆเนาะโอ้ยมันจะถึงมันไม่อยู่อะไรปากเลยเขาแล้วเนี่ยเทอร์โมพิเล they say you can't walk this battlefield without getting blood on your toes if you close your eyes You can hear them. Their final war cries. Before every last one of those brave Spartans perished. Their voices were silenced that day. But their story will be sung for an eternity. You didn't bring me here to talk about dead Spartans. What's on your mind, Herodotus? The Battle of Thermopylae still echoes in our hearts. But to stand here... Is to feel it in your bones. There's nothing here but ghosts. My concerns are with the living. Hold out your spear. My spear? What for? I need to know something.
Hirodotos. I'm fine. I'm fine. The stories are true. That is the spear of Leonidas. The hero's blade. What happened to the traitor, Ephialtes? King Xerxes paid him well. But treachery breeds treachery. A contract was put on his head, and he died as he lived. A coward. What happened to Leonidas after the battle? Xerxes was famous for honoring warriors who fought valiantly against the Persians. But Leonidas infuriated him so much, he cut off his head and impaled it on a pike. A bloody battle ensued, and his remains were reclaimed by the Spartans and buried here. Now, however, he rests where he belongs. In Sparta. Where were Sparta's allies? The Spartans weren't alone in facing Xerxes and his hordes. Many from across the Greek world were armed and ready to fight alongside Leonidas and his 300. But when the mighty king looked into their eyes and saw fear, he sent them home. That sounds like madness, not bravery. It was foretold by the Pythia that Sparta would lose either its freedom or its king to the Persians. Leonidas made his choice. You knew this would happen. I didn't know, but I did suspect. There is a place I'd convince myself was a dream. Until now, a peculiar structure on the island of Andros. Mysterious shapes carved in stone, like nothing I've ever seen. You want to sail to Andros so you can show me shapes? In my travels, I heard whispers of an ancient civilization, a people who came before. Your spear and that place are connected. You mentioned the people that came before. Who were they? They were not gods, but they lived far longer than any mortal and were far more intelligent. I've seen carvings in caves, strange symbols that suggest it was this ancient civilization that created humankind and provided them with fire. But Zeus blamed Prometheus. Yes. Well, perhaps his eagle has been feasting on the wrong liver. The spear awakened to you, Herodotus. I trust you. You understand. I will do everything in my power to help you find your mother. I promise. But first, we must sail to the island of Andros. I'll meet you at my ship. Welcome aboard the Adrestia, Herodotus. Will you be traveling with us? Only for a short trip. 
I have business to attend to in Athens. Herodotus is helping me find my mother. Seeking help from the gods has put Herodotus on your path, just like they put you on mine. They work in ways beyond our comprehension, and all we can do is follow. Go on, Dos. Wow, we're guy, guy, ni le. Okay, go with the guy. You could be the. Herodotus and I share enemies too. Like in Pinor, he is. Was. Part of a very powerful group called the Cult of Cosmos that controls the Greek world through the Oracle. Control the Oracle? Impossible! Apollo would not allow that. Now they're looking for my mother. Oracle lost corruption, and now this cult. Do we know who needs them? I don't know for sure, but I think it might be my brother. Your brother? Why, Zeus? Your life is complicated. <laughs> but don't you worry. This cult of Cosmos now has three new enemies, and one of them fights like Athena. Six thunder like Zeus. We'll bring the wrath of the gods down on them. Is he always this positive? Always. That's why I like him. Poseidon, carry us to Athens! First, we need to go to Andros. To Andros, then! We're going to have to do some upgrades to my ship if we're sailing in the war. What do you mean? Well, she's old, and perhaps not in the best condition. You couldn't have said this before we set sail? Where in the final game are we going to get the supply? My boss is our main that the sea takes, and we must do the same. Fortunately, there are plenty of private ships in these waters that we can board and take from. What are we waiting for? Let's hunt some pirates! Now that we have the necessary resources, we are the towns down. Ah, safe again! We address the Arabs to sail once more.
got them where we Let's want go. them! told me that the Spartan army would be back from the Battle of Thermopylae. Why are you back here? What? Leonidas was her father. Incredible. And it gives you visions. Perhaps it's trying to guide you. Show you a path. There's more. It helps me in battle. What do you mean? I can't really describe it. It's like I know what my opponent's next move will be just before it happens. Fascinating. This is just extraordinary. We are approaching the island of Andros, Cassandra. Yes! Here we can see the tomb of the greatest Myrmidon, Achilles. I was more excited by the fact that Andros exports some of the most expensive marble in the world. Is this the place with the rumored ancient civilization ruins you were talking about? It is. Look for a large gate.
How do I get inside? I wonder if... Hesitation only hastens. The grave, I know, Mater. Your form is improving. Your resolve is strong. But you're not taking action. I was going to. I know. But it's the moments in between that decide everything. Your turn. Leonida's spear. You're old enough now. My father's spear holds a certain burden, but you're ready. something. Huh? The spear. It has magic. Carries with it a long line of power. A bloodline of incredible heroes. The same blood within you and me and our family. All of us? Think of Leonidas. He had great courage. And he made a great sacrifice. You share in his blood and the strength he possessed. We are able to feel certain things happening around us. That is our family's gift. But not everyone understands that. Some recognize the power we bear and want it only for themselves. They will try to take it from us. I won't let them. I know. You're a warrior. If we keep moving forward, always moving forward, we're untouchable. Storms coming in. Then maybe we should move forward now. <laughs> Mother, I haven't forgotten you. Exist? 
ปิดสนาอะไรอีกแล้วล่ะ How could I even explain this to someone like Marcos? Something's glowing over there. มาที่ไลล่าตั้งงั้นน่ะ Themos the forge I knew I let you stand the animus too long your vitals are crashing you don't understand this confirms it Cassandra didn't just have Isu technology she had the means to improve it imagine how powerful the staff could be I admit that could be an incredible find but right now I'm the doctor and I take care of you now get some rest before you go back to Cassandra If you insist, but only because I've got work to do on the outside. Please just clear your head. The last thing we need is a cell leader suffering from the bleeding effect and spearing us because we're Hittites or Thracians. I won't. The Thracians throw great parties. Don't forget, we're a team. We'll back you up until you're finished your investigation. I know. Kyoshi secured the loft yesterday, and he's keeping an eye out. Elena's on call doing historical research. And I'm here to talk if you're feeling any confusion from the animus. Always the therapist. So, Doctor, how do you feel now that we're closer than ever to the staff? I believe this staff is important. But the Templars and Assassins have found staves of Eden before. Nikolai Tesla blew one up in Russia, if I remember correctly. This is different. If what I saw in Egypt is true, this staff doesn't control minds. It controls physics. Time. Imagine rewriting the rules of the universe. The spear you found is right here, and it's not doing anything. The spear is attached to a bloodline. Leonidas, Cassandra, and Themos, I mean, Alexios. They were intimately connected to it. Are you sure you can use the Staff of Hermes, then? No. But if the Templars get it, they won't stop until they find someone who can. So, what do you think of my new Animus? You mean, our new Animus? That's Abstergo equipment. Which I've modified to within a millimeter of its digital life. It's an Animus console prototype, Brahmin variant, with the I.O. capacities pushed to their max. Ultra portable with more calculating power than NASA and CERN combined. I'll go stretch my legs. Too bad we don't have access to the Abstergo gym anymore, huh? Membership costs too much. Leila, can you believe we're meeting Herodotos himself? I can. He sure does talk a lot. Is there anything I can help you with? So does what I'm seeing as Cassandra match your research? I had to tweak the Animus to use what we have of the book as reference. That book is a lost work by Herodotos. He basically invented the concept of recording history. And other figures are matching up too. Cleon, Pericles... The chance to see the past firsthand is why I joined the Assassins. Most people would talk about justice or leaping across rooftops, but history's cool too. I've loved history since my grandpa told me stories about his grandpa back in Ireland. He was an adventurer and sailor, so I'm continuing the family tradition. I feel so lucky. You make your own luck, remember? Why do people keep telling me that? So I've met Irodotos, but I don't know much about him. He's 
brilliant. His histories are considered the foremost textbook of classical Greece. People have made their careers analyzing his words for some new perspective. To see him in his own world, walking in the polis, and... Sorry, but he's kind of a hero of mine. You can fangirl all you want. Yay! I'll leave you to your work. If you need anything, just let me know. โอเคฮะเดี๋ยวไว้การสตรีมข้างหน้าเดี๋ยวผมมาเล่นกันใหม่สําหรับเอ่อการไลฟ์สตรีมครั้งนี้ก็ขอยุติเพียงแค่นี